So there's two big benefits. One is you're not going to have trouble getting an MRI scan. All you have to do is get your device reprogrammed on the way in and on the way out, and you can get scanned in most places in the United States. And the other thing is, especially in the Medicare patient population, you know that as a, provi a, as a provider and an institution, you're going to get paid. Those are the advantages. And your patients don't have to worry about even the small safety issues that we know can occur in legacy devices. The real benefit of an MRI conditional device is that it allows the patient to be treated just like everyone else with the most appropriate imaging modality for their condition. That way you really don't need to think of them as a cardiac device implanted patient. They are just a patient. When a patient presents with a new cancer diagnosis and they happen to have an MRI compatible device, it automatically resolves a whole host of logistical impaired delays and issues that the patient and the cancer team would otherwise have to deal with. And we know that those delays in cancer diagnosis and treatment are often associated with significant detriments in cancer outcomes.